Hello guys, um, welcome to a new video. Today I'm I'm going to make a barn tour of over the whole area that I have here on this table. Um, so it is a while ago that I made a barn tour and I made a few changes around the barn. Yeah, a lot of them. Um, so I switched the winter theme to summer theme or spring um, so yeah I changed the theme and I changed a lot of other things I made a new stable a riding arena and two paddocks and I'm going to show you uh, how I made them uh, how they look like and stuff so it is a really long time ago that I made a barn tour um, yeah I didn't make them because I don't have much time to make any videos or edit them so a lot of videos that I made are really old and not updated anymore so if I had a barn tour it was a really old one and that's just not the barn anymore it's changed a lot and I can't uh, show you something that isn't there anymore that's what I think about it so I hope you like this a little barn tour uh, give this video a like give my channel a subscribe and comment down below what you want to see for the next videos I also made a few changes around the barn of course so I could also now made uh, make a piece realistic role play so if you have any stories ideas just let me know in the comments and I will work on that like vlogs or something So, the first thing that you will see when you come here uh, at the barn are these two lovely paddocks. These are really big paddocks actually. Um, so, you know a slag horse, like uh, the Friesian stallion, maybe you know how big he, he is. And yeah, it's actually pretty big. And that is a collector Shetland. Shed so if you know how big uh, the pony is, or the, yeah, the pony is, then you know how big these paddocks are. There is the second one, also like um, horses, so that you know what the size is. Um, so yeah, it's really big and divided in two. One uh, one open side there, and one open thing here, so that the horses can leave and enter the paddock of course with halter and leap rope okay then you come here and this is a, a two stable kind of barn um, this is a Christmas stable and it has two trees a little fence there and some flowers here and some storage kind of thing benches and of course two ponies so um, I made a chain of a door and you can open and close it and the, um, the fighters, the start of the fighters, I made them myself. The lights, I made them here. Um, I like lights a lot and I want to keep my barn really full of lights. I love it. So these are the two uh, staples I got here for you see the paddocks and then go to the stables so yeah it has bedding inside of them um, keep it nice and clean I'm still going to add a lot of uh, accessories and details to the stable but that will come over time I did uh, now the big projects and I still have a few projects uh, that I want to do I want to still make a lunching um, area for horses so I will have a look when I can make uh, that sort of thing um, but at the moment this is actually pretty much done so yeah I love this table very much so I'm going to use it for a lot of photos then 
we are going to turn around and we have a riding arena we now have a inside riding arena um yeah it's really big and long um it's mostly a diorama um it's mostly going to be used for photos and stuff so yeah it has uh, some jump um, bars there some nice decoration light brown a bit a little bit of uh uh tear it down brown so not the really nice brown but a little bit older painted kind of layer so yeah i know what i want to say sometimes i, I just don't know but this is the riding arena and uh, it has sand inside so that it gives a more realistic look and I really love it and I'm going to use it a lot for photos then we have here a little tree this is uh, a self-made tree with a little bench with, on it um, here I want to make a lunching area but I don't know yet if I'm going to do that here we have a very big stable ahead of us um, here is the tech and feed room, so the door can open and close. I hope I can let you see that. Yay, it can open. You can have a look inside, I can't show you very well, but it works. So yeah, it's really nice. And then we have some flowers here. and some little hooks on the barn its side um, that are places that you can tie up your horse to groom him or saddle up, tack up, how you want to call it. Um, here is our, the first horses or horse and foal. The Frisian mare with her foal is in there and the door can open and close open and close and it has a mechanism a closing mechanism that you can move so that you can close the door at the side here it's a little closing thing so that you can close it and the other two stalls have it too and what the cool thing is is that you can um, if I can move it that you can open the other side of the roof I'm going to show you better but you can open it and you can um, pull a wall out of the stables so it's really cool I'm going to show you that in a minute so now I made it open here and you can see the stables here and the walls between them and the little tack room here I can access much easier the tech room and the feed room. Um, as you can see the tech room is not quite finished yet. I want to finish it but not all the horses that are here uh, have tech already made. So I need to make it still. Then I want to show you that this back piece wall can open and close. See it can open and close. So this is now closed and here I can close up the roof. It has a little mechanisms again. I just call them mechanisms. I just don't know what the other name of those pieces are. But you know what I mean when I can open and close something. So yeah, this is the barn and I really love it. I just um, finished this barn or the three stable barn in uh, a week yeah I, I worked on it seven days a row and the paddock I made in just one day um, it was really easy to do and 
yeah, you, d you just put it apart here. You can pick it up and the horses will be running free. But you know what I mean, uh, that you can pull it away and easily set it aside when you want to make photos of the back side. So yeah. And then the riding arena, I worked on this for like a weekend, so two days. I worked on this, I painted the walls white and it edges brown, put sand in it and made those three hooks for the uh, jumping bars. So this was the uh, barn tour. And I know a lot of horses are here, even though they don't fit in the stables anymore. For now, I have the grey riding pony there, the Dartmoor mare there, in the stable, the Frisian mare and foal in the deep barn stalls, kind of thing, and Lancelot from Ria, uh, painted by Brochette April. If I say it right, the name will be here in the screen. And at the last one of the sabers, there is the um, Fjord uh, from Collecta. So yeah, those are the horses and the rest is Schleich. Those two are Schleich. Those two are Schleich. So these horses don't really fit into the barn, but I do like them here in those pastures. So this is the Frisian. The Collector Shetland, Holstein and Vol from Schleich, Shetland Vol from Schleich, uh, Falabella or Falabella Vol and Mare from Schleich and the Shetland from Schleich also. So, these are all the horses that are on here and I'm going to leave them like this here. I'm going to make a for them. A cute lead ropes with halters, parapet sets and other stuff. So if you have any tech ideas or any other ideas that you want to share, please share. Uh, I would love to know your ideas. And I'm going to ask a lot of times on Instagram what you want to see for new tech pieces and stuff. So uh, this was it for the barn tour. I want to talk to you. To you with my webshop that I have. I sell some of my tech products, others uh, as well. I have other artists on there too. So uh, yeah, if you want to have some tech piece or a new paint, you can uh, place it uh, an order or commission on there. Um, the prices are reduced, so that means that the prices are lower than they once were. Um, so yeah, it's really cheap actually now, <laughs> um, so because of the shipping costs, the shipping costs are really expensive and that's why I am reducing the prices, um, because it's just a little bit much. So that's why I done it and uh, yeah, the quality will not go down or something, it will be the same and stuff. So yeah, if you are interested in new tech or like you want special for your horse, for a new repaint or a custom you have, you can place a commission on there. You can uh, order all sorts of things like riding sets, carriage sets, rare pet sets, stable sets, halter sets. So really cool stuff you can order right there. So yeah, if you are interested, take a look. And I want to thank you now for watching. Give this video a like, give my channel a subscribe. And don't forget to click the notification bell. And I will see you with a new video. Goodbye for now. Ta-da!